Oh, hey there. Welcome. I'm just cruising around in my new Bugatti here. You know what I love more than my new Bugatti? Knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone, Phoenix Fella here. Welcome back to another Farming Simulator 17 Mod Spotlight. Before I get too far into this Mod Spotlight, I wanted to uh, first apologize for the what I'm labeling Monday Mishap, where I start streaming... Uh, and didn't mean to. I was actually recording a, a, a test video with OBS to check out my new overlay. And, well... Yeah, I hit the wrong button apparently and I was re streaming the whole time. So, sorry for those of you who thought there was a stream and showed up. Thank you for showing up. But, uh, yeah, I, I couldn't stream. I, I wasn't able to stream at that moment, so I had to end it. And I tried to explain it and a lot of people were getting upset because I wasn't speaking to them. But... I don't know. But anyway, welcome back uh, to another Farming Simulator mod spotlight. First up is the Bugatti. I don't understand what's the point of Bugatti and Farm Sim, but hey, it's here. Um, it is kind of underscaled, though, so beware of that. And it sits really low, so um, I know on some maps, I, I tried it out on the Texas map because it's super fast, so it's a great, great... Uh, vehicle for checking out new maps and I was checking out the Texas map and it got hung up on the railroad tracks as you cross over the road like this map has a smoother transition over the road uh, than what Texas did but uh it got hung up there but it's fine on this map so ooh, some frame drops here let's get raw into other mods um first up we have the Steiger I've been wanting to do this one because this is a beautiful beautiful mod let's get a cultivator to pull behind it why don't we maybe there we go um let's go with that one yeah it's a little bit more oh you know what no 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 let's sell this and let's get this one since it's new Alright, so the Steiger does have a few options to it. God, I, I love I love the Steiger tractors. Alright. Some of the mods I wanted to include in today's uh, mod spotlight will not be in simply because a lot of things have changed and uh, there's some of them aren't available anymore, so we're gonna stick with what's available. Let's just go twin wheels. Okay. I I want to say the green's off. Like, isn't it more of a limey green? Like the other ones are are more limey green. Not that much. I think this one might be a little off. Something's hitting my frames hard though. Oh. Out. All right, let's unfold this thing. This thing is huge and it is power hungry. It says that even when you download the mod, this thing de demands a lot of power. And we're ready for liftoff. Soon. <laughs> Boom. All right. Bad boy lowered. There it is. As you see, it is plowing. Or cultivating, I should say. Is that dirt? Is it getting dirty that quick? Holy crap. Make sure the lights work. Something over there is wreaking some frame issues. Alright. So by far, one of my favorite tractors. I'm finally glad there's one for 17. Uh, there wasn't really good that many that were really good for, for 15. Um, there was a pack being worked on, but I don't think it ever came out. But yeah, this thing looks good. Uh, I think the, the color is a little bit off, and that 
green for the tires. It's just like baby food. <laughs> but anyway, it's it's pretty awesome. Let's check out the interior. Looks looks really good. Let's tap over to the versatile. Oh, look at that. What the world is that? Is it the cords coming through? Cords, hoses coming through? Oh, wait. No, that wasn't it. Something over that way is wreaking havoc on my frames. Alright, so this one we have... It's got a lot of different. F okay, maybe I'm wrong. You have the stock turbo and two bigger turbos. Always good for the biggest, why not? Crawler, default, wheel broad, wheel weights, Michelin wheel pack, narrow twin wheels. What's that look like? Like it skipped leg day. Customize. They are triple wheels. Looks like just duels. We're going with it though. He can <laughs> They're like, it's like the same size as having duels on it. Like, look, let's compare the wheels. It's not much bigger than the dual wheels on this Tiger. Look at it. pretty funny I like it though so that way it doesn't stick out like crazy like Tyler likes it but you still get get triple wheels on it and this pulls it no problem either All right. it's a two cool old old big tractors for you guys for those of you who like the older feel don't want everything brand new uh, which is a lot, well, you don't see that much around here. A lot of you see is new tractors, old trucks, and and old trailers and stuff like that. You don't really see much old tractors. I, I have a feeling it's this. I could be wrong. Yeah, it's going to make for me wrong. So here we have a... Might be that, tr that fog trailer. We have a F... Was it 450? 350. Dump truck. Is there something we can haul in here, maybe, possibly? Be a good truck for the landscaping folk. You like to do landscaping in, in here. It'd be a nice truck for it. Of course. Of course. And there's nothing planted. So, of course. I'm wondering if... Let's go ahead and sell it and see if that's what's causing our prob our lag. Or our frame drops. Because I'm solid 40 right now. That's what it was. Oh, wait, no. It might be this. No, I'm back up. Okay, down. Okay. It clearly does not know what it wants to do. So let's hop in. These three are all the same. I'm not going to take the time to drive around all three of them. Because they are practically the same. The only difference is this one has the regular body on it. 
Um, this one has a a service truck body on it or a toolbox body on it. What the world's going on here? Hello. Okay. And this one has the welding bit on it. Wow. Okay. Whoa. 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 Okay. I thought it stretched across both of them. I was like, whoa it up. So yeah, here we go. We got the welding. The welding bit looks awesome, man. That looks great. Um, I'm trying to just try to keep selling stuff off until you know what? Let's hop in. Hop in the Ford. Let's hook up to this. Oh, it's that. Look at this. Turn screenshot mode off. Now, there was a version released on uh, ModHub to Rambo's site. And his, you could pull behind and it had the beacons and stuff. Okay. You ain't gonna, you ain't gonna go for me, are you now? See, told you Ford couldn't do it. <laughs> Let's check. Lights work. Cab lights don't work. It is a beautiful truck. No interior. Does the... Yeah, toolbox doesn't open. Some of them the toolbox does open. Oh, there's a guard rail there. I really like the way the tires look in this thing. These look super meaty. Looks like a truck you'd see. I actually wanted to add the um, the service truck to uh, the logging map, but I never got around to it. So yeah, there's there's that Ford. None of these have a back attacher. Can we pull it with the... Heck yeah, let's pull... <laughs> let's pull it with the versatile. Yeah. Super legitness, man. But uh, Rambo released a version that you could haul around. This version actually has uh, the skirting from what I remember the, the one Rambo did didn't have where you could set it up. I, I could be wrong. I could be could be completely wrong, but I don't I don't remember it having it. Ooh, it's a long load. Actually, I think I still have Ramblos in here. I was going to take it to the trailer park, but that's a long haul for as slow as we're going. So let's just set it up here. Oh yeah, it does have the signs on it. Is this me or is it, what the world was that? Maybe it was because the sign was on it? That's weird. That was pushed in there, that was weird. It must because the sign was on it. So yeah, this one here. And the cool thing about this, you remember in 15, when they released in 15, how you could touch them and they just roll away? Uh, it doesn't do it here, so that's awesome. Um, let me go miscellaneous. Yeah, this was the other one that was released. I think the trailer might have been what was causing the problem.
Yeah, see, it just has. It's not gonna let me do it. it. Doesn't have the skirting and all to it. It kind of stinks, but it's a fun toy to haul around. So there's that. Let's hook up to this, which is a T. This truck is beautiful. I love this truck. And this is a new logging trail that's out, so we're going to go cut down a couple trees and see if this sucker will pick it up. I see the victims. Oh, might help if we had our handy dandy chainsaw. Okay, maybe that doesn't that one it's not oh this, these will work for show sure. let's chop this bad boy down there we go now let's shave it cut it in half maybe I don't think this whole thing will load up on there. Alright, now, let's hop in here. Left side, no, we want it on right side. Start, well, oh, hold on, let's get backed up here. Let's turn on the auto load. No. Maybe because it's too small? Let's just cut this one down and see... I know the other one, if they're, they were, they had to be cut so short because they wouldn't. Huh. I cannot get it to load. Stop. What, maybe they got the sides mixed up? No. That's weird. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's got the all load on it, but it's not picking up logs. I don't know what's... Hmm. Me don't know. Me don't know. Alright, let's get a... Let's get a... That's fine. We got... What? Oh, man. The inversion, man! The inversion! I had one CB looks like the one my dad had in his, his pickup. But this this Freightliner is super beautiful, man. God, is it amazing looking. I'm... Oh, it, it's so confusing. My brain's not used to it. Lights work. Got different stages. Blinkers. 
blinkers both front and back work reverse lights reverse lights work uh, the, the only option this truck has is the different engines it doesn't have change colors you'll have to do that outside of game if you wanted a different color but god it's a beautiful truck go to another Freightliner cab over this one also you can change the colors of it look at that wobble oh yeah This one's not inverted. Yay. That actually looks like a pretty nice combo. Really nice. Super nice. Both of these trucks are beautiful. Alright. What else we got? Tow trucks left. Alright. So here's how we're going to test this. Oh wait, we got a couple more things left. There, scoot! <laughs> oh, no, no. Yeah, yeah, hold your horses. Will that pull something else? I, I never tested it out. No, I won't. Okay. So here's one. Let's check out the beacons on this. Holy beacons. Interior. Mayberry Heavy Rescue. Oh, yeah. Pretty awesome tow truck. Let's have into the next one. This one's a little bit bigger. Bail? No. There we go. It's on. Cool beans, dude. One's a single axle, one's dual axle. Alright. Now we got the heavy, heavy rescue. We drew right to the pole. Pole must not have collisions on it, man. Alright. See if I can get this to hook up.
Alright. The work bar lights. Oh! Nice. L. Nice. Front supports. Hood. Oh, somebody stole our engine, bro. Oh no, it's there. <laughs> I thought it used to be yellow. <laughs> My bad. From this far, it looked like it was gone. I'm blind. It's okay. B. Battery box. Alright, toe attach. Let's see if this works. Attach. No. How's this work? I couldn't, I, I, I never could get this one right, the work, because I got this one too. Which, this one does the same thing. I might be doing something wrong, because... Let's go ahead and undo it all. Same thing. Okay, attach. Detail. I don't know. That's weird. I might be doing something wrong because I, I couldn't get either work. I've seen other people with videos uh, or pictures of them working, so. Maybe something I'm doing wrong. I don't know. I do not know. Let's get up and get these last two done uh, so we can get this video rendered and up to you guys for Wednesday. Right, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm just going to go down the middle of this road. Why not? Right? <laughs> Alright. There we go. There we go. Dang, those came down real fast. All right. Lego. That's what I'm talking about. That's how you cut grass. Another cool thing about these, these came over from 13, which they still have the 13 store items, which are store uh, pictures with the green behind them. Awesome stuff. Oh yeah, these are, these are totally going in. Oh yeah, there we go. There's the open field. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. So, yeah. Pretty freak. Ooh. Texture in it. Oh. <laughs> That's weird. It's like the texturing turned green on those. Is it on both sides? Yeah. That's weird. Huh. That's crazy. Alright. So, let's head up to the last one. Now, this is... This was the, I think this was the release for the $500 goal for Modders Without Borders thing. 
looks beastly. Put your hands up. For those of you who are wondering about how I lift things like this, like this palette, uh, it is a mod I featured a few mod spotlights back called uh, Game Extension. Uh, there's a setting in there where you can lift more. Hello? No? Okay. <laughs> okay, that's how we're gonna play it. There we go. Makes the, this job a whole lot easier if you uh, don't have the mods, or most people already have the mods, or have maps that have the fertilization and seed already on. That should be enough. We're just gonna do one quick little swoop. Here's where we're going to swoop at. It is unfolded. Evidently it wasn't... Oh, yeah. Nice. It's like, what cultivator? This thing's awesome. Really nice work. Really awesome work. I like it a lot. So that's going to do it for today's mod spotlight, guys. If you did look, if you did look the video, if you did like the video, be sure and leave a like down below. If you guys want to see future mod spotlights, be sure to click subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.